What up, folks? I'm Walter Zell, and today I have a review of the Transformers Legacy Evolution Dino by uh, Dino Bot <laughs> in the car class, which means we have all the pieces of the puzzle. Six of six for Volcanicus. That's right, my zones, but I hate to tell you, you're not going to see that in this video. This video is all about little snarl, just like all the rest of the videos were about the components. I will be transforming it, gut tying it into Volcanicus and giving that its own review separately. So do stay tuned for that. Um, you know, it might not be right after this, but it'll be soon enough. Nice art right here. There is Snarl. There's not much else to talk about. So without any further ado, let's get to the review. And here is Snarl all out of the package. And he's really, really cool in robot mode. Dino mode, you know, it's, it is what it is. <laughs> Just like the rest, they are what they are. Um, for sure, the core class figures, Dino mode is um, not their stronger points. The robots pretty much look better across the board. But I think this one looks the best of all of them. Not that we're going to go over the robot modes of the other ones. I'm not going to be transforming them back. Uh, you know, we're going into Volcanicus after that with those. You'll see them in uh, Dino mode. But this guy looks really good in this mode. And uh, I got to say, I really, really uh, like him a lot. He comes uh, with his sword. And, you know, it's just done in gray. But it looks pretty cool. That sword is attached to some nice black fists. There you go. Glossy, nice. You also get glossy black right in the middle here. And uh, at the head. So let's zoom in there. Get that head sculpt. It's pretty good. Gray face, blue eyes, black helmet. Everything looks pretty decent. And the chest has some nice glossy red paint, which I like a lot. Very, very good. Really nice sculpt, honestly, for something small, you know? I like it. On the back, you do have to uh, put this on, you know, out of the package. So this is also glossy red paint, and the dorsal fins look really good. Back of the legs, you know, I mean, you know, <laughs> it's not going to be that much to talk about. But up here, you get some molded detail. On the side, you get some nice molded detail. The bottom of the feet, really, really good. You get those little legs here. You know, that's going to happen. But... The silver is beautiful, and uh, it really enhances all the sculpt work at the bottom of the legs. Very, very nice. Really, really good looking. Top of the legs, you know, they're okay, but whatevs. The rest of the arms have decent sculpt, too. I really like the split tail up here, forming like wings. Again, I, I talk about that a lot, how I like that. The, the wing aspect of uh, Dinobots and how that's very super robot -y and how that's like... You know, influence so many Super Robot shows afterwards. Um, there's so many. Gosora, let's say, you know, and uh, some of the Brave stuff. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. It just does. Look, diecast content. I see it. Um, but this is a very, very nice mode. And he's got some good articulation, too. The head moves, swivels, swivels here. You do kind of get like a butterfly joint here, sort of. But kind of. And this is on a ball joint. Otherwise, you get a hinge. No swivel at the wrists. The legs can split. Not fully, but can split. Kicks forward, goes back. And then the knee has a nice bend to it. And that is it. But you know what? You can get this guy in some really decent poses. You know, there's enough here to do so. So I like that. I think he's pretty cool. I'm really enjoying playing around with this. So yeah. Uh, it's it's a good one. And for your size comparison uh, for something different, how about uh, one Transformer in each of uh, the size scales that Transformers has here? So uh, we could get a good picture of how Core Class, Deluxe Class, Voyager, Leader, and Commander Class work. But with that all said, there's only one thing left to do, and that's transform and stomp out. And 
And <laughs> yep, here is Snarl all transformed up. And um, you know, from the front part here, he's better than the Studio Series. Uh, he looks cooler than Studio Series. At least this snaps in well together. Uh, yeah, it still, you know, comes together. Her head has to come together, but it looks way better. Big Autobot symbol on his face. The eyes look very nice. There's zero articulation in this mode. Zero. The, uh, silver looks really good there. You know what? This is gold. And I haven't sung it, so silver and gold. So yeah, life, nice silver and gold there. Uh, re silver really looks good in this mode and like the legs together look real nice um and then you got the red here didn't notice it before but this this is, is actually red paint and it's uh coming up on, on this one right there so yeah the only one paint wow that's a lot of paint it almost looks like blood um hopefully it's not the bottom just looks like that he's got little little feeties there he's got feeties here and then he's got this at the end of his feet makes you wish they made this so it folded in they didn't though <laughs> that's what happens with these little things it's just yeah he's got a little tail which looks cute i do like it uh, and then he's got all this thing going on here um you know this and this part looks really good the tail is fine these front feet uh back feet are very very bad um but it's black, so I guess you could kind of, like, lose it in the background. Like, if I put it down over here, like, you can't tell it's there. So, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. The sword can go up top here if you want to store your sword. Give him one giant spike up there. Uh, or if you want it to go the other way, I'm sure you could do that, too. Like so. Now he's got a sword blaster. Um, is there any place else to put this? Not really sure. Didn't see anything in the directions, so. Would have been good if it c could go down here, but, you know, none of this stuff really fits well, so it's not really made for that. But yeah, you know, he looks okay. It looks okay in this mode. So, you know, it is what it is. I guess this, these feet could go like this if you want. Not supposed to, but I guess they can. Uh, he stands well, though, at least, you know? Kind of looks good like that. So, yeah, a little snarl. He's a little snarl. His mouth doesn't open or anything, but this part is really nice, isn't it? I think it is. And whoops, there is a spot to put it underneath. There's a little slit right on this chest. How did I not notice that in robot mode? Um, so you can put this under there, like so. Pretty cool. And uh, for the size comparison we've been waiting for, here is all the Dinobots together. The core class Dinobots who are all going to combine to form Volcanicus. Not in this video, once again, but coming up soon. I'm looking forward to doing it myself, guys. Uh, of course, i got to find all their directions or probably just look online. Uh, but, yeah. This is a pretty cool to see them all together. I love the colors, you know what I'm saying? They all have little hints of the gold and the silvers and the silvers and the gold and silvers and gold. And a lot of red. Not a lot of red, but red where it counts. And it's cool. I just like seeing them. They, are they the best? No. Um, but it's still cool. They're the Dinobots. And I love the Dinobots. And this is awesome. Here he is with the uh, Studio Series a Snarl. And I, I really like this little guy better. Um, yeah, he's got more articulation and stuff, but man, that thing, I don't like. The tail, I don't like how it's shaped. I don't know. He could have been a lot better. Uh, I, I prefer this guy with <laughs> little fists in the back and all. And my final thoughts on this little snarl. I like him. I really do. Even in this weird uh, dino mode with his fist hanging out in the back, uh, I still think it looks good. I, I honestly think it looks better than uh, the Studio Series. Um... I do. Um, so it's cool. It, it is very cool. And the robot mode is excellent. So not so bad, guys. Not so bad. We still have Volcanicus 2 put together, like I keep saying. So do stay tuned for that review. We're going to be transforming these guys into their limb modes. And then we're going to put them all together. A little combine and gut tie and then a full review of Volcanicus as a figure itself. So do stay tuned for that. Not exactly sure when it's happening, 
Uh, I have Nova Prime here to review. You saw him in this review. That was the debut on film of Nova Prime. So he's got to be reviewed still. And I got a couple of other packages in transit as well. So, you know, do stay tuned. A lot more Transformers to come. That is for sure. Uh, it's been quite a good year for me and Transformers again. I'm very, very happy to be featuring them as much as I have. It is one of my true big loves. And there you go, guys. That's my review. Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure to go ahead and sub yourself for daily content and diversify your collection. Get some Dinobots. Till next time. Peace out, peeps.